morning, good folks. Monday, vlog day. Uh, Saturday, just released a new short film entitled The Beast. Please go check that out. Uh, let me know what you guys think. It's probably uh, some of the some of the content on the channel, like of that, like of the content of the channel, like that is a part of like stuff that's like very close to my heart. I guess you could say. Um, I don't know. I was very excited about it. So either way, please check it out. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, sorry about the shaky camera there. Uh, second, uh, the audio for yesterday's podcast. Once again, a little rough. Um, I think what's going to happen with the podcasts is I'm going to be taking a break from them for now. Um, I don't know. It's just I keep running into these audio issues. Uh, it was never happening before. Um, so instead of using my phone to record them now, uh, yeah, I think I'm just going to put them on pause. Um, the microphone I have my eyes on is about 150. Um, so I don't know, maybe in the next month or two, um, we'll have a proper microphone for all that and to do like the voiceovers for short films. Um, but yeah, I'm going to put the uh, podcast on on the uh, sideline for a little bit. Um, I don't know. I just I don't want to keep putting things out that uh, it's not really up to uh, the standard of quality, I guess you could say, that uh, we've been reaching. So yeah, Walking Dead today. Finally get to see what happens with Eugene. I've seen some previews and I'm not fucking, I'm not too excited about this. Uh, but either way. It's going to set up a lot of things for the story. I'm always down to see more Jeffrey Dean Morgan as Negan. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to go get myself into that. Stay tuned. I'm sure there will be more footage for today. Well, as you can probably hear in the background, watching Walking Dead. And holy shit, it is off to a good start, folks. See my little boot rack right there? Moving up in the world. By the way, hat's all crooked and I don't even care. I'm worried about Eugene, though. I think he's going to get sucked into the saviors. Fuck. I love how even though Eugene is scared or whatever, like, you still see flickers, like, of his personality. And I love how he went back to certain things from, like, much earlier in the series uh, that got him out of situations back then. Um, it was also cool seeing, like, Negan and Eugene have this dialogue together. Uh, because this is all like a like for the show. Uh, this never happened like in the comics or anything like that. So, either way, I don't know. It's really dope though. Enjoy, definitely enjoying the episode. Uh, Dwight's about to walk into some house. So let's see what happens. Eugene, Eugene, Eugene. I have a feeling this is not going to end well for him, which sucks. Says him and his grimly gunk or whatever he called it. I don't. I don't know. I don't want anything bad to happen to Eugene, but I feel like the way he's acting right now, he's, it's not gonna it's not gonna end well for him. All right, that was a pretty dope episode. Uh, one thing I did like is uh, how they explored Dwight and Sherry's storyline a bit. Uh, the letter from her and like what you see from Dwight and everything as well. Uh, I think he was actually gonna try and escape, but I don't know. You can definitely tell he did remember the good days. She didn't give him credit for that, though. She didn't give him credit. Uh, I don't know what this means for Eugene, though. Um, maybe some double spy shit is going on. Uh, I don't know. I really hope it's not like he did just say fuck it and join the saviors, though. That's, that's no bueno. Oh shit, we got some chicken with a little bit of old cheddar on it, some grapes, baby carrots, some little tomatoes, a little Caesar for dip. Oh, so colorful and tasty. Alright, got a package in the mail. What the fuck? Alright, well, one set of Wolverine claws came in. I ordered the pair and uh, only got one. 
You'll have to send a message, I guess. All right, send the message. Uh, hopefully, if I get the other set in, uh, or maybe it just shipped separately. I don't know. Either way, uh, at least I have one for now. Better than nothing. Uh, just kind of sucks. So I was expecting both of them. Well, I can't really lie. The whole Wolverine Claw thing kind of threw me off. So I'm going to get a workout in, catch up on one of my favorite podcasts, get back on track. Alright folks, before we get out of here, there's something I wanted to talk about. I actually, I've been, I find it very interesting, and uh, I want to hear your guys' thoughts about it too. There was a test done with mice and everything, based on like the theory of what we, like what humans call cell memory. So, they took mice, and I might butcher this a little bit, but bear with me. Um, and I believe the mice at some point, like they were pregnant or something like that. So... They would go onto a walkway or whatever, and it would have, like, lemon juice or something like that, and they didn't like that feeling. So, the mice that they gave birth to, when they smelt, like, when they even smelt, like, the lemon juice or the citrus kind of thing, they started freaking out, because they, it was like, the fear and everything was passed down to them. So, with humans, I think that we have a lot of certain things that kind of, uh, might fall into like almost cell memory like it might come from like our ancestors or something like that you know what i mean um it, i don't know i think it's pretty interesting it could be also one of those things like maybe we're afraid of insects like some of us anyway maybe some of us are afraid of insects or whatever because at some point like our ancestors had to be like careful of like where they were sleeping or whatever because like insects could fuck them up or give them in, like infections or whatever it is you know what i mean um but yeah let me hear your guys thoughts on it and other than that thank you for checking out today's vlog make sure you guys like share subscribe comment below i might not reply to them but i do read them all uh please go check out the beast the short film i released on saturday uh check out last night's podcast and roll the outro